I just got done watching Rhett and Link, and they put a cockroach under a magnifying glass, or a uh, microscope for a while, and I thought that was really cool, so I thought it would be neat to give it a try. Now you'll notice I'm wearing rubber gloves. This is not because the roach is dirty. Um, I handle these roaches all the time without gloves on. I'm wearing the gloves for contrast, just so we can see the roach better. Thought it would look better on video than seeing my nasty chewed up hands. So let's switch over to the macro lens and get a closer look. It's a female roach, that's her back. Moving up towards her wings. They just have little nubs. It's not technically a wing, I don't think. Well, man, that might be a wing. I don't know. I should have researched before I started talking. And there's the piece of carapace that goes over her head. We'll see if we can get her head. She'll sit still for us. See, it's like a shelf over her head. They're very docile. Let's see if we can get to her belly or her legs. Come on now. I'm not even squeezing her. I just get her at just the right angle. And she quits trying to run. And get up close. Look at those feet. I wonder if we can get closer if I put the macro lens on my phone. Let's look at her legs and there we go. All right. That's it for now. She's actually alive and unhurt. She's just scared. She'll start moving in a second here. There she goes.